If you need an online degree but don't know what major to pick, have no fear. This list is based on these things and also on what topics are best to learn online and how easy it is to graduate that four-year degree in one year, which is what we talk about on this channel a lot. And at the end of this video, I'll also share the best online colleges for busy adults to earn these majors from. Public speaking would be silly to learn online, but do you know what's great to learn online? Writing. And that's because most of learning how to write is actually just writing and then getting written feedback from a more experienced writer. Good majors include English, creative writing, business marketing, strategic communications, and journalism. Now, journalism as a career field is kind of down recently, but actual established authors don't do too badly, and technical writing as a field, people are actually making a median $80,000 a year, and their field is growing. But the point here is that if you have to learn online, there are some subjects that are just better saved for the classroom, like having debates in a philosophy class, or getting to do hands-on experiments in a biology class. But there are very few subjects that are better for learning online in a written word-based environment than writing. Plus, no matter what career field you're going into, written communication skills are always valued in the workplace, not to mention in the application process to get into the workplace. Business degrees are the Dallas Cowboys of college majors. Are they good? Sure. Are they everywhere? Yeah. Do people love them? Definitely. Will they get into the playoffs? Most years. But are they going to win the Super Bowl? No. Most of us work in a business of some kind, so betting that you'll find something practical with a business degree is like betting that Travis Kelsey and Taylor Swift are going to break up. Sorry, I don't know where all the football references are coming from, but the point here is that if having a bachelor's degree is just checking a box on a resume, having a business degree is like checking that box with a slightly thicker pen. It's good social proof that you are where you belong. And it's a great degree to do online because like 95% of what we do in businesses is done on computers anyway. But the real strength of a business degree is that they're very easy to hack. Which is just this channel's way of saying that these degrees are very flexible and will allow you to transfer in quick and inexpensive credits from around the internet so that you can graduate extremely fast. Like we're talking months instead of years. Plus, lots of schools offer portfolio credit for work experience, which allows you to graduate even faster. All of this adds up to graduating in under a year for somewhere between two and $13,000 with the Swiss army knife of college degrees. The healthcare field is growing fast, and if you're smart, you can make a lot of money. But I don't mean smart in a book sense. Don't even bother becoming a doctor or a nurse because the quickest, easiest way to start making healthcare money is on the business side of managing healthcare. Start as an administrative assistant or some kind of data or account specialist and work your way up to being a medical office manager. These guys handle staffing, scheduling, insurance, logistics, supplies, hiring, firing, basically everything in healthcare that's not actually healing people. And the median pay is about $100,000 and their career field is expected to grow in size by 32% between 2022 and 2032, which means low unemployment and high job security. Plus, this is such a practical degree and so much of it is based on policies and software and data that it's very natural to learn online. You're not going to be missing much by not doing it residentially and you'll graduate with highly valuable and well-paid skills. We talked about business a minute ago, but anyone can get a business degree. Not everyone can get an accounting, finance, or economics degree. These degrees have to do with a lot of math and spreadsheets, so I like to call them the nerdy business majors. And like with most nerdy career fields, they pay very well. Accounting is the least exciting career that I could possibly imagine for myself, but they still make a median $78,000. And then financial analysts and financial advisors both have a median pay of $95,000. Most of these fields are growing fast and they're not super sexy jobs. You don't have to worry about a bunch of people one day all being like, well, you know, I think I'm going to go and be an accountant and then, you know, coming for you, competing for and taking your job. They're harder than your average business major and I wouldn't recommend them unless you feel the need to spend all day with your calculator. But because they are calculator degrees, it also means that they're very natural degrees to learn online. And they all, especially finance, are gonna be some of the highest paying degrees that you can possibly earn online. Would I sell my soul to a calculator to do one of these majors? No, but I do pay somebody else to help me with my taxes and to help me run accounts for my businesses. And that's why these majors are always going to be a safe choice. Okay, how about using your computer 
to earn a degree about computers. We just released a video about five online computer degrees that you can earn in under a year, some of them in under six months. And you can check that video out here. Be warned, it is going to blow your mind. But generally, the quickest to earn and most applicable computer degrees are going to be computer science, information technology, and information systems. Computer science is kind of a generalist degree that's often a very good on-ramp to a master's degree. But what it really focuses on is developing or creating software that other people can use. Information technology is about using that software to help businesses achieve their goals. Information systems is my favorite. They're kind of like IT, but less technologically skilled and a little bit more business focused. They're more likely to use the software and interact with IT to help businesses make effective decisions and to run smoothly. All of these fields average in the like 90 to $120,000 a year range. and almost all of these fields are growing dramatically. But the real poetry of a computer degree is that if you like computers, you'll feel right at home earning one of these degrees online from your computer. This is my favorite major, except for my own personal English major. But what I call a Chipotle degree is really like a build it yourself degree. Schools will call them different things, interdisciplinary studies, general studies, liberal studies. It's always some kind of like vague school word plus studies on the end. Chipotle degrees are normally blank, but with a few rules. Like with this interdisciplinary studies degree from Liberty University Online, you need 48 credits in the major, but only three are chosen for you. The other 45 credits have to be pulled from areas of study that you choose for yourself. These degrees are amazing because they're flexible and super focused on the needs of an online adult learner. A, you can transfer in tons of credit if you pick the right focuses, and that can be from an experience at a previous college or from non-traditional sources from around the internet that we talk about how to use all the time here. And B, it can be customized to your goals. When I chaired an interdisciplinary studies department, we had a student who wanted to be a medical textbook illustrator. But as far as I'm aware, there's no such major. So we created a degree for her that involved art and anatomy classes, which made her the single best prepared person in the entire world to illustrate medical textbooks. And even if you don't need that kind of niching down, you can still give yourself skills and perspectives that help set you apart from other applicants. However you approach a Chipotle degree, as long as your job field doesn't require a specific major that already exists, this major is going to be the quickest and the most well-fitted to you major that you could imagine. This sounds cheesy, but 85% of people work in a career field that has nothing to do with their college major. So if your job doesn't require a specific degree, just pick a major that sounds interesting and that you actually want to learn about. Plus, having a unique degree shows something about who you are to employers. So an English major might communicate that you care about written communication, or a history degree might show that you are a really good researcher. Maybe a graphic design degree shows that you're creative, or a math degree that you're analytical and good at problem solving. And whether you're learning online or in person, you are going to enjoy that degree way more than any other. If this video helped you make up your mind about the perfect major, it's time to pick the perfect school. And if you want to graduate quickly and inexpensively, like we're talking turning a four-year degree into a one-year degree and graduating for under $10,000, then check out this video about the best online colleges for busy adults. Thank you for watching and happy